All right, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. Happy Wednesday, wherever you are around the world. You know, the markets are looking once again extremely bullish. You know, we're seeing altcoins really flying. And, you know, this right here is the start to an altcoin season. Sure, it's not something that we are used to seeing where we see explosive moves. But, you know, this is the start. Because if we're looking at it on the weekly time frame, guys, look at how well altcoins are performing. But today's update is regarding none other than Polygon Matic up 11% on the daily time frame. What exactly is going on? Why is Polygon Matic pumping? And is this pump going to continue towards the upside? Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. So if you guys are not familiar with Polygon 2.0 Boost, you know, it's one of the many positive updates surrounding the Polygon ecosystem. The defined transition of Matic to Pole is one underlying trend many in the community are looking forward to. Too. So if you guys are not aware, you know, Matic is transitioning from Matic to Pull. So it's going to be rebranded. And of course, that is a factor. But the main factor, in my opinion, is that, you know, the coins, the three specific coins, if you guys know which one I'm talking about and where I'm really going with this. Remember Cardano. Remember Solana. And there was one more. It was Polygon Matic. All three projects were labeled as security by the SEC. And fast forward, uh, you know, July, August, you know, we saw the XRP lawsuit come to an end. And that really brought in a lot of interest. But Polygon was one of the coins, even Cardano, that lagged behind the entire market. But guess what? Investors see what the project is doing and they also see the growth potential and you know polygon matic is one of the coins over the past weeks that hasn't really been you know outpacing uh the entire market but that is changing and it's changing right now so let's take a look at polygon matic see what is happening and of course where we could be seeing the price going in the immediate short term so you guys can see this for yourself you know, you know the price is currently sitting at 80 cents up 11 percent over the past 24 hours in usd comparative up 11 percent in bitcoin and eth comparative over the past 24 hours but now let's take a look at its market cap 7.4 billion dollars and the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 600 million not bad not bad but let's take a further look at the price and see what really is happening right now in the immediate short term. So what you're really looking at right now is, you know, the price of Matic did make its way past this level of resistance. And if you are a regular viewer of my channel, literally, let's go back down memory lane. Let's go at the beginning of this year. And also during the bear market, you know, this resistance is extremely, extremely important. You can see this for yourself. Pretty much all bear market, we did hold you know above this level of support we did make our way back down this june you know once the sec announcement did come out and you know matic was labeled as one of these securities we did see the price go down to 51 cents and pretty much i would say that was the low yeah you could say you know the wick back on september but pretty much around that range uh, was the bottom and if you somehow were accumulating within that range guess what you're up right now about 61.4 percent you know matic is one of the projects uh one of the potential uh you know big players that a lot of people look at that reminisce you know how i talk about caspa and i say you know there's reminiscing feeling you know matic was one of the projects that is similar in a way of course tech wise there is a difference at the end of the day. All these projects are trying to compete. But, you know, what Matic was really here for was to fix the scalability issue for Ethereum. We know, and that still exists. But, you know, Matic as a blockchain, you know, it has seen tremendous amount of growth. And I've seen this firsthand. I've seen this project launch on the Binance IEO. I had, if I'm, I kid you not, I've shared this story a million times, but I know there's so many newcomers coming into the markets. You know, I've seen this project, you know, go from, you know, a couple of, not even a penny, you know, it was like 0.000 something to literally it's all time high. 
which was at three dollars almost and i missed out i missed out big but you know it's making itself as one of the big leaders in the space but speaking about leaders the competition is insane so that does not mean that matic is not going to gain a lot of traction is gaining a lot of traction and one thing that gets me really, really bullish on uh, Matic is, of course, the development side of things and, of course, the partnerships that are making. Aside from that, you know, when the bull market did not even start, at the beginning of the year, we had like a mini altcoin rally. And I think that was just a complete fake out. But you could see this for yourself, how good Matic recovered literally from its June 16th lows. You can see this for yourself. From the June 16th of last year lows, if you picked some up, you saw Matic go up 362%. Matic was halfway to its all-time highs, and we weren't even in a bull market. And this time around, what's happening with Matic is, of course, we have gone above this level of resistance. As I've told you guys countless of times on the Matic updates, a lot of resistance in the way a lot of resistance is coming up in the way but if we're able to clear this um, 89 cents zone you know we could be making our way up to this one dollar matic price that we have not seen guys since may of this year so you know it's been quite some time since the price of matic has been there but slowly but surely i think this is the main target that should be on people's eyes you know after after the likes of Solana and Cardano are seeing some massive growth, you know, this can bring in more attention to Matic. You know, of course, these are all competitors at the end of the day. Uh, but, you know, when it comes to investors taking a look at it, they are seeing an opportunity because Matic really hasn't had that move as of now. Because if we're still looking at it just from the October 9th price, you can see Matic is up. 54% from that range. So I think there's still a more potential before we kind of see a little bit of a cool off and a consolidation happen. Uh, and as we do go more towards the further upside, I still think there is some steam left for Matic right now. Main target that I'm aiming for is at that dollar mark. But let me know down below what you guys think right now. Are you guys accumulating? Uh, polygon matic look at what's happening with the bitcoin dominance bitcoin dominance once again is pulling down which is really helping a lot of altcoins today you know really push towards the upside so you know the bitcoin dominance index should not be taken that uh, you know slightly it is a really really important indicator one of the best indicators i love in the markets but let me know down below what you guys think about polygon matic and where you could see the price of matic going uh, at the end of this year and of course how much do you have in your portfolio um, and what are you most bullish about on Polygon Matic and how does it differentiate in your opinion to Solana, Cardano and of course um, you know the other uh, you know competitors uh, to themselves so let me know down below your personal thoughts uh, overall things are looking great um, but uh, you know time will tell as to what happens and also let me know if you guys want to see more Matic updates and I will bring you guys just that love you all see you tomorrow in Crypto ZX and peace out